We say broken but beautiful. Yeah. Still nice. It's getting a little windy, but I found a oyster and it's hinged. Found one of these the other day too. That's beautiful. And it's fully hinged. I know I mentioned this before, hopefully it's not too windy. Uh, it's probably going to be, but we had a storm roll through a hurricane a couple days ago and it, the shelling has been really great. I've been out three days in a row. Um, and again, shelling in Maine, um, it's not like Florida. There's usually, I say usually, there's usually not like piles and piles of shells. Um, but. I really love shelling in Maine. You can find really, really great species that are cold water species from the Labrador current uh, that get washed down um, right out here in the Gulf of Maine uh, and then get washed up onto the beach. Um, and it's really one of the only locations in the U.S., uh, at least on the eastern seaboard, where you can find these Arctic shells. So it's, it's really rewarding when you have a good day shelling in Maine. That's what excites me here. Look at the color of this quahog. So we picked up some that are like bluish. This one is like red. Really, really cool. It's, I wonder what caused that coloration. That's nice. I'm definitely gonna hold on to that one. That's really beautiful. Okay, you know, another northern moon. This one's got a little bit of seaweed on it, and it's a little pitted. As shells often are, they've been tumbling around in the surf for a while, but nonetheless beautiful. Y'all, I am not kidding right now. Look at what I just found. Look at this. <laughs> this is a whole Iceland scallop. O-M-G. Holy. I am so excited. I found a this is my first whole Iceland scallop ever. Again, we are storm shelling today in the remnants of uh, Hurricane Fiona. Wow, this is, that's unbelievable. That's a razor clam. Notice the side. Beautiful. Another beautiful little northern moon. Love that one. It's nice. Guess what? <laughs> Another moon. So the moons I'm finding today are pretty small. Nor uh, often they can get as big as your hand. Uh, but these guys are pretty cool. Very tiny moon snail. Northern moon snail. Y'all, you're not going to believe it. I found another piece of an Neptune. <laughs> That's cool. Now, these never wash up whole. Almost exclusively never. They always look like this. But that's, uh, that's freaking awesome. Look at that. Love that. Definitely going to hold on to it. 
and a really colorful. are interesting. This is called a jackknife clam. I don't think I've ever featured this on my channel before because they are not the most common shell to find on the beach. But uh, yeah, that's a jackknife clam. Okay, here's an example of one of the clams that is dark. You know, we found that uh, orange one earlier, but this one has not, has been sitting in sediment and that's washed up. It's like a black gray. It's beautiful. This is an Atlantic surf clam, but um, has that really cool dark coloration. I love these. Really cool pair of horse muscles here, hidden by some kelp. Such a beautiful shell. The purple and the pink. It does have a, a creature on it though, so I'm going to leave it be. The tide will pick that back up on its way in. Here are a couple of periwinkles. That is a really nice one. Uh, that one I'm going to leave, but this is a really, really cool one. So I'm going to keep that one. Now look at the size of this slipper. This is massive and so beautiful too. Look at that. That's gorgeous. The top sides are not so beautiful. The inside is really nice. Okay, I see something that is hidden here. A little inconspicuous. But you gotta have a good eye. Is it whole? Yes, it is whole. That is a false angel wing. Beautiful little find in the seaweed. So many people walked over this today. That is so gorgeous. It's one of the biggest ones I've ever found too. Love it. I found another angel wing. There's quite a few of them on the beach today. This is my third or fourth one. Awesome finds today. It's got to have something to do with the rest of this storm. So cool. Alright y'all, I am really excited. It's not whole, but this is the piece of a, I believe, pittock shell. A great Atlantic pittock. These are super rare and I've never found one whole, but that is pretty gosh darn close. So I'm going to keep it. That's a really cool find. Look at this. Beautiful shell, man. Ah. Oh. 
And over here I saw another angel wing. Such cool finds today on the beach. Wow. You can see uh, a lot of different drift and clams have uh, been washed up here uh, from the storm. It's just a lot, a lot of clams as far as you can see. So we'll check and see what we can find. Yo, we got another hinged, hinged angel wing. Look at this. This guy's hinged. Never found one hinged before. So cool. Okay, y'all. Found a whole piddock. This is a whole one. Really beautiful. Wow. Never found a whole one before. The texture, the contour, the gorgeous shell. here like this coarse uh, yellow flat periwinkle tons of little dog winkles nice nice little moon right here yeah look at that beautiful moon snail oh my gosh man oh I think that's a northern moon. That is unbelievably gorgeous. Look at all of these mussels here. Look at this. Look at this. <laughs> Look at all these shells, guys. Oh my gosh. Oh my god. Look at this. They're everywhere. Okay, we got a soft shell clam. This is a pile of shells, y'all. A main pile of shells. Woo-hoo-hoo! All, all of these just washed in and got piled in. Oh my god, that's amazing. Wow. All right, I'm gonna close out the day here. Hopefully the autofocus isn't going. My other camera died. So I had to switch to this one. Autofocus is a little bit jittery on this one, but uh, I want to close out this uh, last day of storm shelling and um, really, really great day of shelling in Maine. So let's see what we found. Okay. I don't want to break anything, but you know. Ah. Okay. All right. Look at all that, y'all. That is some beach bling. All right, we'll start up in the corner. We got a beautiful jackknife clam, a couple of those. I haven't featured those on my channel yet, so those are kind of cool. Um, we have some Atlantic razor clams. If you notice the beautiful purple-hued interior. Uh, we have some periwinkle snails. Uh, I believe those are northern periwinkles. Uh, here's some Atlantic surf clams, but I don't usually collect these, but if you notice, you can see the difference in uh, color that these have. So you got the dark gray one there, you got the reddish brown one here, and then the slate colored one here. Uh, so I just thought that was really interesting, the three different types of colors there. We have a northern whelk. These guys are pretty common in Maine, uh, but that one had a little yellowish hue, so I liked it. Uh, we got some slipper snails here. Notice the beautiful purple interior. We got some soft shell clams on the bottom. We got some beautiful blue mussels here. Notice the difference in color and texture of these. Uh, next door we have a cousin to the blue mussel, which is a horse mussel. 
if you notice the beautiful purplish red. Uh, we've got some Atlantic dog winkles with some fiery orange color and some chocolate stripes. We have some uh, northern yellow periwinkles. Those are always fun to collect. Usually find those in and around tide pools. Uh, we have a uh, Atlantic Pittock shell. That is the first whole one I've ever found today. I found this one today earlier and thought that was cool and then I found a whole one. These are actually pretty hard to find on the beach in Maine so I'm glad I found that. We found tons, tons of angel wings. These are false angel wings. Usually they're a little bit more difficult to find on the beach but I think with the storm we just found tons of them. Found some beautiful oysters. Uh, this one here is hinged so it's still together. Got some beautiful northern moon snails here. Not the large ones that we normally find, but those are beautiful nonetheless. We've got a Neptune and my favorite find of the day. The first time I have ever found a full Iceland scallop and I found one. I was elated when I found this. I found pieces here uh, throughout the storm. So these are some of the beautiful finds from Maine today. Awesome stuff. Thanks for coming along. And as always, I will see you on that next adventure.